Empire Comics this morning. Hey, Absolutely. Coach. Absolutely. Ben, it's back on. Give me hey, five. Hey, hey, hey. look at that. He's prepared. <laughs> uh, of course, last season ended on a big cliffhanger. Spoiler alert, people. We're going to talk about The Walking Dead, and hopefully you're caught up. If not, hold your ears. Yeah, go watch the last episode. Mm. It was fantastic. The, the reveal that Negan is finally showing up. Uh -huh. uh, for Walking Dead fans, he is probably the best piece of this entire show. Oh, yeah. Uh, and for people who, who haven't read the book, you guys are going to love this man. He's brutal. Uh, he's, he's savage, but he's also a very reasonable individual. He is, and he is charming as well. There's very a little much bit of so. a charm to him, which is weird because he walks around with a baseball bat that has barbed wire on it. So I don't, that's not the uh, charming it, part it of it. Named book. Lucille. Yeah. Uh, Lucille is actually a, a pretty prominent character in the books. Uh, <laughs> really she is. will be on the TV show, too. <laughs> okay, what'd you bring us? We got to get caught up. What, okay, what should so, I read? Uh, if you're going to, if you haven't started, uh -huh. if you guys watch the show, if you love it, the book is essential because even though you use the same characters, the same settings, things are different. Yes. Things switch. So mm -hmm. characters' deaths might not happen. Um, Andrea is still alive in the comic books. Right. Um, so everything's different. It's well worth it. This here is the very first trade. You're, on a book like this, you're not going to want to start anywhere else. You're going to want to get in on the ground floor, see how it all happened and where it came from. You can get it this way, or you can get the compendiums, which that. is a hefty, hmm. hefty guy. But these guys are well worth it for the price. It's half the cost of buying the individual. Oh, excellent. So that's, both of those are a good place to start. I brought this over here because, Negan, uh, we know we left the season with him about to uh, execute somebody to make a point. I uh, see very reasonable. Yeah, he's, he's just, <laughs> just one person. As one um, does in the zombie apocalypse. I'm yeah. not going to ruin who it was in the book, but who do you think it's going to be in the television show? Uh, I think it's two people. Okay. Uh, I think it's, I'm drawing a blank, the guy with the, the mullet. Uh, is that Abraham? Abraham. Abraham. Yeah. Okay. Redhead right dude. Yes. yes. Abraham. I think it's Abraham. See, I think it's going to be Abraham too mm. because they built him up so much last season. Uh, him falling in love, him kind of breaking down those barriers. So if we take him out, it's going to leave a real emotional impact yeah, on people. I think so. And the, the fact that things were going okay for him, that, that, that in, is a in sign a of doom. Yeah, <laughs> in a show like this, that is never a good idea. Um, so what we have here is this was actually a charity project. The Image does this sometimes with big books, brings in big artists uh, and some uh, people who aren't quite as big as some others. In fact, we have a Sacramento local here uh, hey. who will be at SACCON. His name is Newligan, oh, like awesome. Hooligan, but with an N. Uh -huh. You can find him this weekend, uh, and you can find him. He actually does a uh, book called Union Street Choir oh. that we have at the shop. Yeah. Uh, so it's his own comic book. You guys can uh, check him out there. That's really Highly cool. Highly recommend it. Uh, and this one for all the kids, uh -huh. a coloring book. Uh, <laughs> the coloring book thing is huge right now. So Walking Dead jumped in on it. Why would you not want to, you know, color some of your favorite horrific scenes from the book? <laughs> You're going to need more red. You, you, you are definitely going to need more red. red pencils. And this one, um, Walking Dead really doesn't venture outside its own book. There's not a lot you can get outside of the core title. Image has this book, which is a ton of previews that comes out every month showing you what's coming from them. Oh. But there's a backup story in it uh, for Walking Dead every single month. And in fact, the first one is all about Negan and his backstory. Oh, and we cool. learn where the name Lucille comes from for the bad. That's a good get right it, it there. It is. It's absolutely amazing. Uh, ben, you're going to go out right now to SatCon, right? Yep. Heading over to SatCon, uh, setting up a booth. So stop by and say, hi, guys. I'll be under the... Uh, uh, bootleg pub section. So I'll be with Newligan and his book as well as Trixie Dynamite. Excellent, excellent. Good to see you. And by the way, Friday's 11 o'clock because oh, Ben so much fun. hasn't figured out he should lose my phone number. Uh, does a little <laughs> thing with us where we talk about the CW superhero shows. Good to see you, my friend. Thank you, sir. Have fun at SACCON today. Back to you, Mel. All right. Thanks, Coach.